You can still see the sentry boxes at the entrance to Osborne Church at Closeburn near Thornhill, where the guards were placed to stop the body snatchers robbing the graves. The new church had been built in 1878, and it had replaced a 1741 building that was itself a replacement for a much earlier church. On the gable end above the door, you can see the coat of arms and the motto of the Kirkpatrick family, being closely involved in the murder of the Red Comyn by Robert the Bruce at Dumfries. The Red Comyn may not have been dead, and Kirkpatrick went back in to make sure, so their motto became, I make sure. To the left of the door is the grave of John Matheson, who was a covenanter. He'd been banished, but he returned to Scotland. And his grave had been later vandalised by a John Kilpatrick of Burke Head, but was replaced. The family mausoleum of the Kirkpatrick family lies to the right, a rather fine structure dating from the 1840s. In the cemetery below, you can see the rather fine, rather ostentatious memorial to the Bairds of Closeburn, who also owned the old parish church of Dalgarnock. The mausoleum of the Kirkpatrick family has a memorial within it to the 6th Baronet, Sir Thomas, who died in 1844. The lands of Closeburn have been sold several times. 1783, the Kirkpatricks have sold it, and the Menteith family sold it again in 1852 to the Bairds. The 8th Baronet, though, of the Kirkpatrick family is an interesting character. He had been a footballer, he was in the civil service, but he played for the Wanderers and they won the FA Cup in 1878. 